Hello everyone, this is Daily Math. Here we have an algebra problem. We have an equation, absolute value of x squared minus x minus 6 is equal to x plus 2. Try to find all the answers and then watch the solution. Good luck. All right, let's factorize this quadratic expression. We can write it like this. We need two numbers with the sum negative 1 and the product negative 6. Something with 2 and 3. For negative 1, we have plus 2 minus 3. 2 minus 3 is negative 1. And 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. So that's correct. Plus 2 minus 3. And then we have absolute value and x plus 2. So the first thing I notice here is that x plus 2 is always positive because this whole part, absolute value of something, must be positive. That's what the absolute value function does. So again, x plus 2 is positive, right? That means this one is always positive. We can take it out of this absolute value function. We'll have x plus 2 times the absolute value of x minus 3 equals x plus 2. Let's factor x plus 2 on this side. We'll have absolute value of x minus 3 minus 1. And that's equal to 0. So this is the first case. x plus 2 is 0 and x is negative 2. That's the first answer. And now for the second case. Absolute value of x minus 3 is equal to 1. And from here, we have two cases. First case, x minus 3 is greater than or equal to 0. Then the absolute value function returns x minus 3 itself. We'll have x minus 3 equals 1. And then x is 4. Does it satisfy the condition here? 4 minus 3 is 1, greater than 0, so we can accept this answer. And now the second case, x minus 3 is less than 0, it's negative. That means the absolute value function returns the negative form of it. Negative x plus 3 is equal to 1, and then x is 3 minus 1, and that's 2. Again, does it satisfy this condition? 2 minus 3 is negative 1, it's less than 0, so we can accept this one as well. 2, negative 2, and 4. These are three answers. And now let's take a look at the graph so that we can understand what's going on here. The blue one is the absolute value of x squared minus x minus 6. And the green one is x plus 2. And these are three intersection points at negative 2 and 2. And this one is 4. Three answers three roots for this equation. Tell me how you solve this problem. Thanks for watching. See all my dear friends in the next one. Till then, take care. Goodbye.